so in the previous video what did we watch we watched what happens when work is done by the gas right that is the system is doing the work on the surroundings now we'll see the concept what happens when work is done on the gas that means it is a reverse uh, direction now let us take an example so here uh, first of all watch the earlier video and come back to the students right so here what are we doing we are trying to fill air in a like uh, into a cycle like i'm using a bicycle pump and i'm trying to fill air into the tire so what what happens there we can do work on the air means means we are trying to do work on the system system is the tire so externally i am pumping in air onto the bicycle tire tire is taken as a system now from the surroundings i'm trying to pump air so so let us write that what did we say we are pumping i'm taking an example pumping air into bicycle through a pump through a pump okay, pumping air i should write that only into pump i'm filling it so initially let us take initially gas has a average i'm just taking an example average volume which is equal to 3 liters okay right now external pressure constant external pressure which is equal to p external that is nothing but 1.1 atmospheres so i'm using 1.1 atmospheres to push the handle i'm pushing that handle the pump when i'm pushing that handle with this so much of pressure what will happen now the average volume whatever was there because i have applied pressure on that uh, pump and i'm pushing in air inside from 3 liters the pump or the volume has reduced to 2.5 liters now let us take w is equal to minus p external into delta v earlier formula which we have already i have told you what is p external delta v so w is equal to how much is p external 1.1 isn't it minus 1.1 atmospheres how much is delta v it is initial the initial v1 was uh, 3 liters v2 is 2 liters 2.5 liters now delta v is equal to v2 minus v1 correct so apply this here w is equal okay here only into 2.5 v2 minus v1 minus 3 now how much do i get w is equal to minus 1.1 into minus 0 0.50 liters if i multiply how much do i get i get plus 0 0.55 liter atmosphere fine so further i need to convert it into joules isn't it so let us take this w is equal to 0 0.55 liter atmosphere into conversion factor 101 into 325 into con to convert into joules to convert a liter atmosphere into joules divided by 1 liter atmosphere this and this gets cancelled w i get an answer of 56 joules okay when i multiply this now what answer did i get i got positive answer isn't it so here you got a positive answer now why did i take this now i'm telling you so basically whenever let us put now into the box whenever work is done on the gas earlier it was by the gas now it is on the gas what happened delta v here is less than zero so what happened to this work work has got become positive positive value so now what happened energy is transferred to the gas basically what actually is happening here the process which is happening here is compression we are compressing it that was expansion here compression correct yes so this is the whole concept whenever work is done by the gas expansion whenever he work is done on the gas compression whenever work is done that is expansion process that is negative compression process positive so let us uh, like uh, summarize everything and uh, so that you will not forget let's see the pv work completely now i'm summarizing it summary 
what is this pressure volume work correct so this is nothing but it can be expansion or compression also so how pv work you know it is a result of volume change against external pressure isn't it right so w is equal to i'll write in this terms also p external or you can write force external okay force external into distance through which piston moves distance through which piston moves and this is the first one first case which i have taken delta l f into d i wrote no i am writing in that term so w is equal to minus f external into area into delta l okay why did i write this because area what is area equal to because it is area is equal area into delta l what is area area into delta l is, is nothing but delta v no correct a area and the displacement how much of a distance it has moved so take this and substitute w is equal to minus p external into delta v this is one formula which i got so w is equal to minus p external into v2 minus v1 final minus initial this is one more formula now what should you remember here most important concept is remember for expansion v2 is greater than v1 that's what will happen expansion terms w is negative remember this second important concept for compression v1 is greater than v2 value does w is positive remember this expansion is negative compression is positive so this is this is the pv work is uh, students i've explained you both work done by the gas as well as work done on the gas hope the concept is clear